Today, we're building a droid. We're at the Black Spire Outpost Industrial Depot, where you can build your own astromech unit, also known as a droid. For me, I chose the BB-8 unit, because BB-8 is one of my favorite droids in the movies. The instructor is showing us so, what we're supposed to do. Like this. Um, the base series pads are going to be this size, like the smaller ones. And then you're going to need a base for it to sit on as well, so I want that. And then both halves of the body are going to come together in a pair like that, okay? Right. So if you guys have any questions, just raise your hand, okay? When I first started building, I wanted something red. So I chose out this red and blue slash teal body first. See there, I chose my body. I started looking for a head, but I couldn't find any that were not flat. And I also chose out my core, which made the droid move. I continued searching for the head, and I found this orange head plate that would connect to the body to make its head move as BB-8 moved. I kept finding these flat heads, but they weren't the type I wanted. So I kept looking for like the dome shaped ones. Then I found this cool clear looking one, but still not the one I wanted. And I kept seeing all this original BB-8 stuff, but that's not what I wanted to build. I wanted to build my own custom one, not some just blue. I decided I didn't like the blue and teal one, and I chose this red and yeah, clear one perfect. instead. And then I found what I was finally looking for, a, a, a silver dome for my droid. And then I started walking over to where I would put my droid together. I took out all my materials out of the basket and put the basket away. And then I had to choose two of these little pieces that would go on the uh, motor to make it move. I chose the gold one and the one that's clear that shows all the wires. And I put them on and waited for the uh, helpful person to unwrap my uh, droid body because it was stuck together. Activating. All right, if I can have you put all your energy into pressing that red button for me. Which one you want to be the top and the bottom? Uh, all right, I'm gonna borrow this real quick. If I can have you place it right in here. You can grab that top and put it right on top. All right, can you push it for me? Thank you. All right, if I can have you grab your two antennas and put it right in there. The taller one, other way. The taller one will go in the bottom. All right, if I can have you grab your little friends and put it right on top. Thank you, and give it a nice big push together. Sometimes they won't push together, all you have to do is just screw it in. And if you could just press this button right here. All right, one more time. Okay. First, I'm gonna put your friend's head right on top. See how it's a little wobbly? All you have to do is slowly turn it and then it'll pop on. Are you ready to activate your friend? Yes. Okay. We're gonna leave your droid on because it'll activate throughout the land. Because you're gonna turn your remote off. Okay. 
And then if you have a tablet or a phone, you can get the app called Joy Tika. Activate it. You can connect your Joy to it. Can I have you put all your energy into pressing that red button for me? As the guy said, I put all my force into pushing that red button so my BB-8 could awaken and we could become best buds. Alrighty. This is what your little friend sounds like. Alright, wherever his eye is facing is the forwards and backwards, side to side. You want to practice? And just to let you know across the way there's a red pad that you guys could drive drive your right around. Did you guys get a backpack or personality? When I first started driving my BB-8, it was kind of wobbly and I had and it fell off the platform a few times. But soon, I got the hang of it. But I almost kept running into other droids. He was a lot of fun to drive around, and if I get another chance, I want to build another one. But this time, I might choose one of the other units. I hope you enjoyed the droid video. It was so much fun to do. Please. Leave a like and subscribe. Hope to see you next time. Thanks, man.